We just learned big news about Tesla Energy. Tesla wins contract for Victorian big battery known as VBB. The size of the battery project is 350 megawatt. That's very big. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here first time, please subscribe to our channel. Give us thumbs up if this report is useful and uh, that helps us tremendously. And ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. Tech EAU is a uh, report reporting that as part of Victoria's ambitions to reach 50% renewable energy by 2030, the state is investing in cleaning up the grid. And who is coming to help? Tesla. Tesla Energy. The latest announcement from NeoN Australia confirms Tesla as the successful candidate to supply the big battery, the mega pack. Tesla continues to be successful in Australia, playing a part in many renewable energy projects, take AU reports across the number of states after famously entering Australia with the big battery in South Australia. I've reported that at Torque News. If you are interested, you can search and find. So NeoN is a France-based energy company that owns and operates solar and wind farms in 13 countries on four continents. Here is a quote. We are delighted to announce that the Victorian big battery has reached this important financial milestone. I would like to thank the CEFC for their renewed trust and commitment towards supporting innovative storage solutions. We are on track to deliver this project before the next Australian summer and are looking forward to playing our part in helping Victoria reach its ambitious target of 50% renewable energy by 2030. I'm going to tell you the details of the size of this project that Tesla wins and also if you are not familiar what Tesla Megapacks are, I'm going to give you some basic specs on Tesla Megapacks. So TechAU is also reporting uh, that that the, the 350 megawatt to 450 megawatt hour utility scale battery storage will gain funding from the Clean Energy Finance Corporation, CEFC, uh, to the tune of $160 million. So this is going to be a $160 million investment and funding. Um, this will provide a critical boost to the state's grid security while driving down power prices and supporting more renewable energy. The project will leverage Tesla Mega Pack along with their AutoBeater software to sell power into the grid. AutoBeater is one of the Tesla's most underappreciated products from the company notes take a use saying AutoBeater allows companies like uh, NEON to autonomously monetize battery assets. AutoBeater is a real-time trading and control platform that enables the stored energy in the Tesla Mega Packs to be sold into the market. That's how valuable it is. This happens at a fraction of the speed uh, and a fraction of the cost of traditional gas picker plants that were put in place to improve the response time of the even slower coal-fired power plants. Tesla even references the success of the Hornsdale Power Reserve on their AutoBeater page. NeoEN estimates that the project will create more than 80 jobs during construction and six full-time. Here's a quote from them. Energy storage supports costs effective, reliable, clean electricity and is key component of uh, uh, Australia's transition to low emissions economy. This project is a world class example of how utility scale batteries can help electricity networks support a higher uh, penetration of renewable energy. The VBB, Victorian Big Pro uh, Battery, will improve grid security by providing extra capacity during the peak summer months it will also continue uh, contribute to the dispatchable resources needed to underpin the increasing share of renewable energy that will make up Australia's future energy mix. So it is expected that it will be operational in the summer of 2021-2022. In summer 2021-2022. Friends, this is an exciting project. I'm really glad that Tesla is participating in this and getting its um, uh, mega pack working for the Victorian 
Radeon Big Battery with 350 megawatt. Um, I'm surprised, I'm not surprised, but I'm pleasantly surprised what importance Tesla's uh, power storage uh, and solar energy and Tesla energy in general can help our world and environment. And also uh, other companies may also come with similar project. And I think that in terms of ecology, the next 10 to 20 years should be much better than the uh, early 2020s and in terms of ecology, cleaning air and pollution. If you're not familiar with Tesla Mega Pack, the Tesla Mega Pack is a large scale lithium ion battery storage product manufactured and installed by Tesla. Uh, launched in 2019, each Mega Pack can store up to three megawatt hour of electricity designed to be deployed by utility companies. Mega Packs can be used to store energy generated by intermittent renewable power sources such as solar and wind. The energy stored uh, can be used by the grid as required, for example, during periods of peak electricity demand. In July 2020, Pacific Gas and Electric Company broke ground on installing 256 mega packs at the Moss Landing substation, which I just mentioned, uh, in Monterey County, California, to provide uh, to provide 182.5 megawatt of power and 730 megawatt hour of energy storage capacity, one of the world's largest. You know, in April 2015, Tesla announced that it would begin selling standalone battery storage products to consumers and utility companies. Tesla CEO Elon Musk stated that the company's battery storage products could be used to improve the reliability of intermittent renewable energy sources such as solar and wind. Prior to the launch of the Megapack, Tesla used its 200 kilowatt hour power pack energy storage products to meet the needs of utility companies with large scale storage requirements. During 2015 to 2016, Tesla deployed a combined of 300 megawatt hour of power wall and power pack technology, including an 80 megawatt hour deployment of power pack and at the Mira Loma substation in um, Southern California. But in 2017, Tesla used power packs to deploy 129 megawatt hour of battery storage at the Hornsdale Power Reserve in South Australia, which I've reported at our Talk News YouTube channel. At that time, this was the biggest deployment of lithium ion grid battery storage in the world. Work began on the Mega Pack project at least as early as the first half of 2018. The Tesla Mega Pack was designed at Gigafactory 1 in Nevada. Uh, you see, Nevada is focusing on mostly on batteries, Mega Packs, and storage, things like that. In July 2019, the Tesla Mega Pack was officially launched. The Mega Pack which is being used by Victorian Big Battery was described by Tesla as a utility scale energy storage product sustainable for power stations and utility companies. Now, Tesla claims that Megapacks would be compatible with Tesla power station monitoring and energy control software, PowerHub and AutoBider uh, that I just said. The company also stated that the Megapack was designed to meet the needs of the large scale battery storage project, similar to the Hornsdale power reserve. Now, when, I, when you're looking at Tesla's mega pack page uh, you can see that uh, in terms of um, specs it's three megawatt hour max energy capacity 10 times faster installation one gigawatt hour plus scale projects enabled now when it comes to gigabyte uh, mega pack giga scale projects tesla says we took everything we know about battery technology to enable the world's largest energy product products and uh, gigawatt hour it's uh, one gigawatt hour uh, project provides record energy capacity enough to power every home in san francisco for six hours Hours. And uh, Tesla says the Mega Pack is a uh, all-in-one system. Uh, the, the, on its website, Tesla says every Mega Pack arrives pre-assembled and pre-tested in one enclosure from our Gigafactory, including battery modules, bi-directional inventors, a thermal management system, and AC main breaker and controls. No assembly is required. All you need to do is connect Mega Pack's AC output to your 
your side wiring and also if tesla says the installation is very fast and adds that at the site level mega pack requires 40 percent less space and 10 times fewer parts than current systems on the market as a result this high density modular system can be installed 10 times faster than current system so it's no wonder that tesla is successful in selling uh, its megabat uh, projects and um, uh, and winning contracts like the victorian big battery which is 300 megawatt in size well friends uh, let us know what you think give us thumbs up please and like this video if this information was helpful and uh, this is armin harian from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel join our community we have great discussions in our comment section on the news and future tesla developments uh, join our community and discussions have a great day god bless you everyone and peace be with you see you soon in our next report